Jen Hewitt. And let me find your introduction here. Yes. Jen is an elder of the Confederated Salish and Kootenai tribes. She founded and serves as the director for the Native American Music Association. She has represented American indigenous people at the Smithsonian and on trips to Europe and the Philippines. During her program entitled American Indian Music and Storytelling, Jen will be playing cultural and contemporary native music of the American Indian and will tell stories of the Ponderé people through music. Jen is an author who also teaches children to write books. She believes that the earth is our mother and we must take care of her. She is sacred and will take care of us. I would also like to acknowledge that this is the 40th season of the Native America Speaks program here in Glacier National Park. It is an award-winning program that has endured as the longest running indigenous speaker series in the National Park Service. This program and other critical projects like it would not be possible without the generous donations of the Glacier National Park Conservancy. And here in Glacier, we acknowledge that this is the traditional and shared homelands of several nations, including the Blackfeet, Salish, Kootenai, and Ponderay people who have known this land for over 13,000 years. We honor with gratitude and the land itself and the people who have stewarded this land for thousands of years. So without further ado, thank you, Jen. So proud of you, Deb. That's what I call a ranger. Yep, and une. That's Salish for all right. Very good. <laughs> Before I start, you know, I, I would like to have uh, a little gift for Debbie. Would you please come up here, Debbie? Is this for me? Yes, this is for you. When, so that when you're at a powwow and you go snagging, you're going to have a blanket. <laughs> and when the music goes and you see someone, you put your blanket around and snag them. Now, you, no excuse. Okay. But you're married, right? Okay, well, just so you know, we have some things for Jen at the end of the program also. But we're going to let her present first, if that's okay. Yeah, but but I, I'm an elder, and I had to give her a blanket before I forgot. And thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe five minutes at the end. We have some things for you, too. Okay. Okay. And I have some things for the audience too, okay? And uh, I'm, I'm going to ask you to just go ahead and, and pass them. It's a book that I wrote. And how about one for every two? It's called Bear Nation. Has anybody seen any bears? Raise your hand. Yes, where at? Avalanche Lake, I bet. Yeah, it's amazing. Is it? Wow, that's pretty doggone good. Speaking of doggone good, we have an we have a guest here. <laughs> he's a dog, mm -hmm. but he's the Lord. Lord what? Lord Stanley. Stanley. Look, come show how beautiful he is. <laughs> <laughs> or she, right? Is it she? It's a he. It's a he. It's a he. It's a he. Of course, the Lord. Yeah. Oh, how beautiful. So I saw them and they said, is it okay if the dog comes down? And I said, this is my last time. Go put him in the lake. They can't do nothing. <laughs> and he loved it. He's only six months old. How beautiful. Okay, there's 20 more loose. Uh, where is it? Right here. Okay. Now. Here's some more, please, passies. So that everybody can share. I was uh, born in 1953 in St. Ignatius, and I went to the uh, high school in St. Ignatius, Mission Bulldogs, graduated from there. And then I went to the University of Montana and graduated from there, and ended up being a school teacher. Can you hear me okay on this? Is this okay? Is my uh -huh. No, you can't hear? Okay, what did I do? Forget something like that. To turn it on? Yes. Well, there we go. What am I, see, this is why I'm retiring. 
but I had a lot of fun here and I was an honor and privilege to represent the Frothead Nation, to represent all Native American people who have friends. <laughs> and we have all you guys as friends. It's so good when you're in the woods. So I wanted to share this because I know we all love bears. So just let's open it up to the first one. There is this mama bear. And this mama bear was in St. Ignatius and she was a grizzly. That's my hometown. Some person had to uh, shoot it. Left the mama grizzly right there on Ashley Lake Road. And now we have three bears. Poor little orphan bears, bears without a mom, bears without a home. What are we gonna do? I mean, there's Mormon and Catholic and Indian and white and I mean, everybody's fighting. So this is good what the bears did. They had everybody in their memory get together and put down their differences. And I'll show you how. Let's go to the first page. Okay, this is for your grandkids too, you know. And so I wanted to show people how the mother loved her children. So here's the mama with the three bears. And this is Hope, my bear, that lives at Finley Point. It's a boy, because no, the mom's not gonna let the girl go out. Same rules as we have. So it's a little boy, about a year old, and it's Hope. And Hope says, my name is Hope. I'm almost one years old. I have a lot of hope because of you, friends. Please remember the Bear Nation, Mama Bear, and all the bears by being our friends, and tell everyone to stop the killing. So then we go and we start the story. Mama loves to give bear hugs. And you can see how close the mom is with the, with the bears. They do everything together. When we snuggle, we look up at the stars. So you see them there looking up at the stars? Now don't fall asleep on me, it's gonna get good. <laughs> Everything is so quiet until the wolves sing. The buffalo seem so nice and calm. And maybe that's because they have the great white buffalo as their leader. Maybe I can ask the wolf and buffalo about the shots we hear getting closer but they do not ask him. I love my brother and sister. I love the four-legged, the flyers, the swimmers, and the crawlers, and the two-legged too. My mama, I love her so much. I feel good when mom looks so yep and nune next to the big mountains. Yep and nune in Salish means pretty. She looks so pretty. Now, someone's coming. Mama's running away from us. And in the background, you can see the silhouette of somebody with a gun. There are shots. Where's Mama? So the way I have been raised, I have been raised when you see a bear, bear. Not beer, work mouth, bear. <laughs> it brings you strength or it's telling you to be strong. So here's these bears, they're pretty strong. There are shots, where's mama? Mama, look, mama. So they're running over to the mama. Mama's not moving, mama's not breathing. Who did this to mama? You can see them being strong. These nice two-legged are helping us. They gave us a home. Now this is St. Ignatius area. They didn't know what to do. They put down their differences. They put, they dug this uh, den and they put apples and oranges and fry bread, whatever they could put in there. And guess what guys? It's springtime and how things have changed. They rolled out about 250 pounds each. They made it. That's, what can, that's how things happen when you work together. And this is what the bears would want 
people to know. All our friends help us remember Mama. Her spirit is always alive. And you can see the Mama spirit in there. So that is called Bear Nation. So I, I wrote a song about it. It's playing in France, thanks to my friend I met here at uh, Glacier National Park last year from Paris, France. And it's playing in France, and it's called Bear Nation. And I'll chant it for you. Okay, you can sing with me, too, when you catch on. It's, it's right here now. I forgot to tell you. It's on, we don't have it numbered here. Okay, but here is the song. Bear Nation. Leave the bears alone. Let them have their home. Bear Nation. Help the bear nation. Help the bear nation. Wolf and buffalo on the hill. Will you teach me survival? They came and killed my mother today. And then they came and took us away. Bear Nation. Help the bear nation. Help the bear nation. Poor little orphan bears. Bears without a home. Bears without a mother. Help the bear nation. Stop the killing. Stop the killing. Some of us walk on four legs, and some of us walk on two. We're on this earth together, and now I'm asking you, help the bear nation. Stop the killing. Stop the killing. Stop the killing. Help the bear nation. Stop the killing. Poor little orphan bears, bears without a home, bears without a mother, help the bear nation. The people came together and made those cubs a den. They gave them food and water, and in the springtime, those bears came rolling home again. We helped the bear nation, and that's what they did. And those bears are in the zoo in Maryland. And they're doing fine. Thank you. Now, what are we going to be doing about about our nation? Usually, I come up here and have people sing with me, and then I open it up. And and last week, I mean last month, somebody was talking from their heart. So I had this circle here, and. At uh, one time, it was a circle, but it's been broken. And we can have peace again. We can be a family again. We can help the bear nation. We can help our nation. So we're going to have a round dance after this. But I'd like you to sing with me today. And could you please give me a, one of my musics? Of course, I forgot it. It's right there by my cane. Thank you, young man. Lem Lynch means thank you. So, uh, I would greet you in Salus, Demos Pa'us, what's on your heart, talk to me, I care. So, this here, let's start with the earth is our mother, okay? Repeat after me, the earth is our mother, and we must take care of her. Hey, Yana. Ho, Yana. Hey, Yan Yan. It doesn't mean anything. It doesn't mean anything. It's like do re ma fa do do re mi la. Well, I forgot that. Do re mi fa so la ti do. It's vocables and pitches and tones. So let's try it. The earth is our mother. We must take care of her. The earth is our mother. We must take care of her. Hey Yana, oh Yana, hey Yan Yan. Hey Yana, oh Yana, hey Yan Yan. Okay, you have pretty voices, I can tell. Let's try it again. The earth is our mother. We must take care of her. The earth is our mother. We must take care of her. Hey Yana, oh Yana, hey Yan Yan. Hey, Yana, ho, Yana, hey, Yan, Yan. The earth is 
our mother, she will take care of us, the earth is our mother, she will take care of us. Hey, Yana, Yana, hey, 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 Let me hear your voices again. It's beautiful. Ready? The earth is our mother. We must take care of her. The earth is our mother. We must take care of her. Hey, yana, oh, yana, hey, yan, yan. Hey, yana, oh, yana, hey, yan, yan. We walk upon her sacred ground. With every step we take, we walk upon her sacred ground. Mrs. Rush, would you help me by counting? Yes. Okay, come on. We're going to find out what tribe this is going to be. Okay, then how many would want to be the bird tribe? Raise your hand. Nine. How many want to be the deer tribe? Raise your hand. Three. How many would want to be the bear tribe? Raise your hand. And how many would want to be the buffalo tribe raise their hand? Bear tribe. The bear tribe got it? The bear tribe got it. Oh, great. To say bear in Salish is in Klamka. Thank you, Mrs. Rush. Yeah. Uh, so in Klamka means bear. And then my son's name is in Klamka Sweetie. That's bear tracks. So I said in Klamka Sweetie. And he goes, I don't want to be a sweetie. <laughs> I know. But he likes his name now. Be before, um, before we get to, uh, together, uh, Bears, I just wanted to say that I went to the Bureau of Union for boarding schools. And I know we're out here trying to camp and get away from things. But in the Indian Speaks program, we really really haven't been speaking. We've been trying to make it really nice and polite. We have been trying to make it a circle because we all know it's been broken. But this is how it looked in St. Ignatius at the Villa Ursula school that I went to with the nuns. They had us take our hair off, cut the hair off, and then they put us in uniforms. And we had a hard time speaking our language without getting hurt. And there's other things that you've heard, and then there's things you haven't heard. But so if the Indian really wants to speak, who is going to listen? We have murdered and missing indigenous women like you would not believe. For the first time I've ever been here at the park, I have addressed this issue only one more one time besides the tonight. And I've had the most respect for the rangers. They've supported us. I mean, Deb even gets over there close to the Blackfeet. And, I mean, she's just in tune. Everybody's in tune to the nature, too. But there was one incident that someone had told me, a ranger here, that was from another state, and I was totally off guard. I was just doing a round dance, singing songs, nothing political, not speaking what's going on and she said and i started to sing this song and she goes oh we don't want to hear that 
Well, I called, uh, talked to my friends, the Rangers, and I, I said I was going to put my resignation in because I'm really too old. I'm, I'm really getting too old to to handle the hatred and I, I just think we have so much love here and we all got to just like keep it together and we have been at the park for years so please continue uh, rangers to over see what's going on I just think it's important for all these lovely people to experience seeing a bear and breathing in the nature so I just wanted to say that. That's how I'm speaking on my last day, so they can't fire me. Ha <laughs> ha. Okay. You have beautiful voices, bears. Let's go down to the second one. It's the old cedar tree. Okay. All right. Oh, cedar tree, clap your hands and dance with me. We are we are we are yeah, hey, yeah, hey. Oh, cedar tree, clap your hands and dance with me. We are we are we are hey, yeah, hey, yeah, hey. Ho. Is there any other tree besides the the cedar tree that you want to sing about? What do we have around here? Cottonwood. Looks like Cottonwood. pine to me. Cottonwood. Okay, let's try that. Would you say no? Cottonwood. Poplar. Cottonwood. Oh, Cottonwood. You guys must be thinking of the sewers over there. Poplar, Montana. Okay, Cottonwood. <laughs> oh, Cottonwood tree, clap your hands and dance with me. We are we are we are we are Oh, Cottonwood tree, clap your hands and sing for me. We are we are we are we are Oh, cedar tree. Clap your hands and dance with me. We are we are we are we are Oh, pumper tree. Clap your hands and dance with me. We are we are we are we are Oh, pine tree. Clap your hands and dance with me. We are we are we are we are Oh, Clap your hands and sing for me. We are we are we are we are Oh, cedar tree, clap your hands and bless me. We are we are we are we are And beautiful voices. Now, the next one we're going to go to is a song I'd like you to have, Bears. Like when you're happy, you're happy. When you're sad, you're sad. Any emotion that you have or want to talk about in your heart, well, this is it. This is a song to do. Wehaya, wehaya, heya, wehaya, wehaya, heya. Oh, ho, ya, na, wehaya, wehaya, heya. They're vocal voice pitches and tones, and that's really a lot of the Indian music. And it's a feeling. No notes. So to describe it, chanting, I would say people do that. But just remember, this is your song now. The bear song. <laughs> Okay, right there. That's where you're losing it. Oh, ho, ya, na, we, ya. Try it again. Oh, ho, ya, na, we, ya. Oh, ho, ya, na, we, ya. Again. Oh, ho, ya, na, we, ya. Perfect. 
Very good, Beers. Now we're going to set you up after one more song here. We're going to set you up with a peace and friendship dance. Okay? And it's going to be a round dance. And Russia is in charge of the big speaker here. Okay. So let's do the circle song. And I'd like you to pretend that you're a bird. That you're a bird and you have long wing feathers when you fly. And you're going to go around the world. Because everything evolves around the circle. Your eyes, the world, the bird's nest, the sacred hoop of life. The four directions, north, south, east, west, the yellow man's our brother, the white man's our brother, the black man's our brother, the brown man's our brother, the red man's our brother. So this is a circle song for that, that meaning. It goes, we circle around, we circle around the boundaries of the earth. Follow me. We circle around. We circle around the boundaries of the earth. Beautiful. We circle around, we circle around the boundaries of the earth. Keep singing it. We circle around, we circle around the boundaries of the earth. Wearing our long with feathers as we fly. What happened, bears? You're supposed to be going, we circle around what happened. <laughs> Let's sing it together then. We circle around, we circle around the boundaries of the earth. We circle around, we circle around the boundaries of the earth. Ready with your feathers. Wearing our long wing feathers as we fly. Wearing our long wing feathers as we fly. We circle around, we circle around. The boundaries of the earth. Could you just do that, uh, Bears? Could you just hold it so I could try to be flying? <laughs> Come on, Bears. Okay. We circle around. We circle around the boundaries of the earth. We live our long with feathers as we fly. We live our long with feathers as we fly. Okay, keep singing. Sing with me this time. We circle around the boundaries of the earth. Sing with me. Wearing our long wing feathers as we fly. Wearing our long wing feathers as we fly. We circle around. We circle around the boundaries of the earth. Eho! You guys are circling, gonna get dizzy. This is so good. You have such pretty voices. Okay, could I please have? Have um, you help me here? We'll put this round dance on. And what I'd like you bears to do is I'd like to just divide this right in half here. And then, uh, Natalie, will you please come up here? Do you mind keeping the video? Thank you. And Natalie's uh, from France. Let's give her applause because she can't, she loves the club so much. Wonderful. Okay, Natalie, I'd like you to go right here and start them up we're going to go to the left i mean okay so we're going to go to the left and go go by natalie everybody go over there natalie right in the middle of the pews oh gosh that's right i'm not at the earth lines anymore these are bleachers i said pews <laughs> keep going yeah ta my mums. okay so then are you ready Mrs. Rush? Okay, yep, and nune. That means all right, let's go. Okay, come on with me. Turn it up all to, to the balloons. 
forward, please. Okay, we're going to go like this, but we're going to go this way. I'm going to get right in front so I can show you. And watch Natalie. She knows me what you do, too. We just go one and two and one. But you can, we're getting a simple I'm Come in. Come in. Come this way by me because you, you, can, you can do it, right? Come this way. And then let's get behind this little ball. Come on, dude. Come on. we got to do it now. One and two. Okay, we got to go this way up that way. Yeah. Okay, we're going this way. Okay, this is our friendship and peace dance. Keep going, you guys, because we need more in those circles. Okay, here we go. We're going to make a circle. <laughs> Sorry. With this broken circle, we're going to make it. Okay, one and two and one and two. It will start now. Yeah, one and two and one. Up if you can. When we dance with the power, we're playing for peace and unity. No more human beings. Okay, we're going low steps. I gotta go low steps because I'm not elder now. <laughs> Yeah, there you go, and then once you get a little bounce in there. Oh, well, that's the trick. 
It's an old Indian trick. That's why there's no more old Indians. <laughs> Stem us, but what's in your heart? Talk to me, I care. Is there someone to replace you next year? Are you really retiring? I, I think so. <laughs> Do you have somebody waiting to take your place? Well, I've sent Debbie 500 people. <laughs> so how about this one, Debbie? Try this one, right, Debbie? Where are you? Yeah, I, I, I don't know if there's anybody who could ever take my place. I'd hate to think so. <laughs> but you could have you just said, maybe. <laughs> Um, I th I'm uh, thinking that it's time for me to work on another book called Bear Nation, um, Wolf Nation, and um, on the reservation. The kids are writing a book, and, and the kids are writing a book, book called In My Grandmother's Garden. So I'd like to work with them on that. And I show them my book, and so I think I'm going to stay home for a while. Thank you, though, for asking. Where are you from, may I ask? Pennsylvania. Are you really? Pennsylvania. Wonderful. Uh, is it, what, what, do you, what do you like best about Glacier? What do you I, think? I have to be mountains. mountains. Uh, the mountains? Well, come to St. Ignatius too, north, go north. There's that bison range, you know. It's so important to see that. Um, big mountains there too. Any other ones? Stem, what? How is the health of the current class on your I, I don't have my hearing aids on, but no, I'm not available. I'm married. <laughs> <laughs> and that's not the proper question. I can't hear you. Would you, would you say somebody? How is the, the health? My health? No, the, the health of the tribes. The house would be health. 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 The health of the tribe? Yes. Health of the tribes. Health. Health. Healthy. Oh, thank you. Okay, um, we don't have money. So let's face it, we're in we're on a high class res reservation in on the Flathead Res. We have a government that has money, but most of the people don't have money. So the health is gonna be Deer meat, but I hear that's good too. You know, I've been eating it. Been, and um, bison. And then we have our fry bread and the commodities, the government surpluses with uh, cheese and rice. So until anybody gets work, or maybe there's a, you know, it's just, it's just a survival we all got to do, you guys. I know it's going to be hard if you have to kill a deer to eat it, but... You might have to. But the best thing to do, uh, what my people taught, if we ever come to a desperate place and get unhealthy, trade. I have some butter. You have some milk? I'll make some bread. Come over to my house. I have a pot of stew. What? I have two mops. You need one? I mean, we just have to really help. So the health was diabetes is high. We have three and one half times... Um, more otitis media than in uh, other tribes and other people. That's inner ear infection due to mal malnutrition. And um, we have um, not very high. We got high. We got up to about 67. And then we're back, and then we were down to 45, and now we're up to 63 as far as life expectancy. Montana ranks very, very high in suicides. The young people aren't doing very well. And, for example, you know, when, when Bear Tracks told me he didn't want to be called Sweetie, he had to learn that in time that being named after Tracks or, or that word meant is important. So, And then I can't understand... Um, why America uh, lets a lot of things happen to Indian people. But then I see the Ukrainians on TV too. And then I see things. And I have to come out of my la la world of, of singing and writing. I, I mean, I, I gotta go to Walmart and make peanut butter sandwiches and try to help people. You know, I just gotta do it. The health is, a, a physical health is, is what I just said. But the mental health is something 
the mental health when when it hurts when when people make fun of you and and you feel guilty and, and you not you can't say or you can't be what you were born to be. I think that mental uh, thing can cause bipolar, schizophrenia. It could be really dangerous. And that's not just Indian people, but it, it, it's what's happening. But out here, at least, at least uh, we have the circle, right guys? We have the circle. Yeah. Can I ask you a question? Okay, how come when I go to a restaurant, they ask me if I have a reservation? <laughs> What's that got to do with it? I'm not even political. What do they mean? I jokes, you guys. Any more questions? Because we're so divided, our own people are divided, it was nice to hold hands and go in a circle. Well, that felt good to me too. What an ending. What an ending to a quite a journey to have you guys here. I mean, I felt that so much. And the way you sing your own song, I wish I knew how to do one of those things. I would have taped it. So, um, without further ado, Oh, Lord wants to say something? <laughs> okay, be kind to the animals, he says. Okay, we got it. And cats. I have cats. In fact, I just have to say one thing before I sit down. This woman that I met here was saying, oh, I'm, I was on Broadway. I graduated from this place. I graduated from that. I didn't say that I had a song on Broadway, The Earth is Our Mother, in some play I can't even pronounce or remember. But I knew I did. Why would I do that? I just kept listening. Finally, I couldn't take it anymore. And I said, if you're trying to say your dog is better than my dog, forget it. I have cats. <laughs> I should have told her off, huh? Okay, thank you so much. And up here, I have a donation if somebody wants to donate. For, for the books for this here CD. I'm working on a wolf song and the wolf song's in there. Jen, is it okay if I come up and say a few things? Yes, absolutely. <laughs> <laughs> here, you want this? Uh, yeah. Sure, if it's not too tricky. Um, I'll keep this short because I don't want to, I really don't want to be the conclusion of this wonderful program. Um, so remember everything that just happened instead of um, maybe my little bit. Um, but we didn't really have a chance to talk about the Native America Speaks program, um, like the history of it and um, just the really amazing role that Jen has played in the program. Um, Jacqueline mentions that this is the 40th anniversary um, that we're celebrating of the Native America Speaks program, and Jen has been with the program for about 30 of those years. Um, so really amazing. Uh, I actually remember when I first started here at Glacier, um, I mostly work on the east side right now, but um, when I first started working here, I worked here out of APGAR um, in 2005. Um, and I remember coming to Jen's programs at the Lake McDonald Lodge and here at APGAR and introducing her and getting to hear her sing and entertain guests um, here at the park. Um, and it's just been really amazing that she's sustained that over so many years, um, that so many people have heard her songs and got to do circle dances and gotten to participate in what she's brought to the park. Sorry. Uh, so anyway, we have something for you. Well, she already spoiled it by giving me a blanket, but we have a really <laughs> extra special blanket for you if you'll come up to the front. 
I guess I get the snake, guys. <laughs> <laughs> this one even has your name on it. Yeah, very, seriously. It's right here. We put your whole name. Here, we have to put it around you first. Let's see here. Whoops, if I can do this right. Beautiful. Um, so, I just wanted to have a moment to just, oops, sorry, I want to bop you with my hat. <laughs> um, just take a moment to um, just really applaud Jen for this last program. You, I don't know how many of you knew that you were coming to such a special program, her last one for 30 years. degrees out, but I'm not taking my blanket off. <laughs> Thank you so much. Oh, it's so beautiful. Sorry, I would have said something more meaningful, but I was... <laughs>